On a previous video, I made this tension tool and pick out of an old coat hanger, what the missus had threw in the bin. And I picked open this basic free lever, non-curtain mortise lock. And somebody commented and says, can you pick a five lever lock open with it? So rather than pick a five lever non-curtain lock open, I'm gonna go one step further and I'm gonna pick open a five lever curtain sided. But obviously I've had to put a bit of a kink on the end of the pick. So that's what we're gonna to do today. We're gonna to put this one to one side. We're gonna pick this open. It's a leg five lever. I will take the cover off and show you after. There's five levers in there. But I just wanna show that basic tools will get these type of locks open. So first of all, let's see if we can do it in my hand. I'm gonna put that in and that's gonna turn the camera around and we're gonna get tension on it. But before I turn it fully, I just wanna put the pick in. It's gonna be a little bit tricky in my hand. So we'll stick the pick in. And now we can turn that fully. Now this is the tricky bit. So I'm gonna hold it like that. Bear with me. And I'm gonna just tension it like that with just that one finger there. And obviously we're gonna pick it. So this is a leg five lever curtain sided lock. I think I might have gone into a false gate then. Yeah, I've got, no, I haven't gone into a false gate, I've got it. So there you go. These will pick open five lever locks as well as three lever locks. So I hope that answers the question to the person what commented and I'll just prove that there is five levers inside this lock. Yeah, I know obviously professional tools work better, but if you don't know whether you're gonna get into picking lever locks, rather than spend a few hundred quid on a professional set, just make some, this was out of the bin. Now you can see there's five levers in there not going to bother taking them all out, but you can see there's even anti-pick notches in the levers. So that's it. Anyway, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you again next time. Try a bit.